I I'm down to be an Aphrodite hater while being a solid first much in lesser duo land. Burst a little bit on that dash. 100% loss rate this weekend. <laughs> Maybe she's not going to be with this semi global pressure from the rat to the Trinobog or the Ratatoskr. Kings of interesting. I'm keep my eyes on Hex Mambo early and Gilded Gladiators late. Kha'Zix trying to steal purple, just a it's bit close. off the mark. Might lose his life for this one, slowed down by the Invader's we'll curse. Constant invades, like we're seeing Kirby now go over to Solo. Julio might be fine, double stun his way, but that rain keeping him healed up. And the Axe to turn around for some damage. Health bar is falling low on the side of Hex Mavo. Gilded Gladiators. Chase him down. Johnny more interested in the shield buff, but he's used his feather step. Kirby trying to catch him out. Jake's going to try and do his best, but only gets the silence after, and the knockback. Pulls Jake back in, goes in for the ultimate, only able to hit two, but it's immune out by Spudio's ultimate. Kha'Zix gonna try to keep him in place, finds the pluck to throw Jake back in his oh, dash, dash, gets stumped, but there's just no follow-up damage this time. And now Jengaru on the way. Does he want it? The Gladiators might have a turnaround opportunity, but Kha'Zix's not gonna dash any further forward. To the solo laners now. Kana rotating out of lane, dashed by Kirmi. Good stun. And a stun on Rapio from distance. Up into the sky goes Kirmi. Jengaru's nearby, but it sends a dunk to Johnny. And caught out inside the jungle. It's first blood for Jengaru. Very good so far as well. They've just really caught out everyone on map. Jengaru goes to the transformation. Gets out just fine. Rapio living at a sliver of HP. That's crazy. Probably single digit health at that point. Bluestone not quite enough to get the kill. Yikes. But now it's going to be Jengaru going down. Axis there. Torrent misses after stun on Julio. And he's just going to fall after Johnny comes back from the grave to pick up one more. And Julio's still alive. Still alive. Goes for the ultimate, takes down Jeremy while still living at a couple hundred himself. Johnny standing by, waiting for Kana to land, but he'll bird for him out. All the while, Rapio had never quite left, farms Amplified up the wave. In that second slot. That would be crazy. It's a lot of damage, but it does open you up to some rotations. Quick ult from Kana gets him away from the potential pullback of Johnny, who is waiting the wings in the jungle. But you rotate the jungle to right, and they send four over to the Gold Fury, Gilded Gladiators. Gonna sneak an objective away from Hex Mambo. Spawning Everybody. soon. I'm not certain the Guild of Gladiators have timer on this one. Snoopy's really low mana as well. He's gotta be careful. Rapio on the way. Pluck hits Jake. Mez not gonna hit this time. Jake's still standing through, but he dashes the wrong way, and Spudio will capitalize off of it. Kirby gets his dash interrupted. Snoopy now no mana and slowed Yikes. down by the lurking in the water. Snoopy's gonna have to give up his life, and the kill goes to Rapio. Another bead yeah, team pulled away. almost the entire early game, but we'll now just have to let this one go so his team can get beacon. With Johnny nearby, action potential could kick off, but Rapio now no beads. Good pull of those. And a significant one. Johnny and Rapio on the rotation. Fight over shield, pull back onto Jake. Grabs him with the gravity surge, and knockback is there. The feather step pulls him out of it, and it's another kill for Johnny. A dunk in this time by Kirmi. Takes down two almost. Johnny's able to jump away. Kha'Zix with a tail whip to zone him out. But Spudio crashes in with the ultimate. Spudio Jengaru. himself trying to get out of this one. As Jengaru catches him out in the back line. Nearly takes him down. And Kha'Zix goes down with a rotation from Kana. Oh, it'll help pick off Spudio. Two kills. Maybe he is the recipient of the damage. So maybe not necessary to go in towards that spear robe. Would likely decide to pick up an aura defense item or something that helps out the rest of his team first. Start Pyro dropped by the Gladiators, Hulo nearby. Snoopy dives into the lane, but it's met by a whole heap of damage. Beads pulled away from the Hunter inside the wall, just waiting to see who his death goes to. It's Rapio with Tycho Trump's ultimate from Julio. Catches a few, Jankar knocked up and pulls the beads, so Johnny can't yank him back, and now it's ultimate from Jake. Hits a few big targets, but now it's just pulling them all towards the Gilded Gladiators, and all this while, Spudio has not left that lane. The only low health bar on Hex Mambo was the support Kha'Zix. Psychotic play from Snoopy there. Just ult in the mid alone. He's got vision on the entirety of Hex Mambo when he's in the air. Here's the thing about Living Nightmare. There. It's like the best. Hex Mambo were just waiting for a mistake, and they were handed one. Kirmi might try and steal this Fury away. One versus four, blinks in, finds Spudio, but gets hit by a lot of CC. Beads and ultimate now used, Close. gets to the sky in time, and the Fury has been stopped. But now picked back up by the Gilded Gladiator. Shingara and Jake holding on to this one. Now Tex Mambo got to try and take it back from them, but it gets reset once more. Gladiators with low health for bars. Hex Mambo, one for both of the frontliners. Kha'Zix unfortunately catches the decoy of Jankaru, costs him a lot of his HP, might even cost him his full life. Jake goes in with the ultimate, it's going to pull only Rapio this time because Johnny flips over it, 
Bacana up on the cloud is distracting as Julio's in the back line, trying to distract Jengar, who goes up into a cloud of his own as the Wukong double dive in by the solo and the jungle, but the Tycho drums are wreaking havoc on the health bars of the Gilded Gladiator. Stun catches Snoopy uh -oh, from Spudio's uh -oh. ultimate. Now Snoopy is in trouble. Jump in by Johnny. Puts him on a killing spree. Hex Mambo went out the team fight. I can't believe Julio's teleport made it through, J-Mac. That is ridiculous. Throughout the entire fight, no one from the Gilded Gladiators spots that ward. Julio shows up in the back line and says, guess I'm going straight in the old. Kha'Zix trying to front line, but he's losing a lot of health. Fury gets reset for a moment. Now Kirmi is by himself, but Yikes! the is still there for Johnny, and he picks him off. It's a Nick healing spree now for Rapio. The Hex Mambo with their eighth of the game and an Oni Fury to boot the 1K lead. On a warpath, anytime he sees an enemy, walk in, pluck, see what we can do from it. It's a pull back to Jake. They he's losing a wow. lot of HP. Johnny and Rapio just have so much damage. Now Aegis pulled away from Jangaru. Does have his beads. It to Jake. Jangaru might as well just be dead if he ever gets pulled back. Yo, my bad, J-Mag. You called for Spirit Robe. I don't know ball. He, he needs Spirit <laughs> Robe if he's going to be getting hit like that. Damage output from Hex Mambo. By the Gilded Gladiator, Snoopy ults over towards Kha'Zix. So now Hex Mambo know that no ultimate on the board for the Hunter. And the Gladiators are starting up the Fire Giant. Kha'Zix in the middle of the pit trying to zone away three. Kirmi goes up onto the tree and it's instead to the back line to try and take down Spudio, who uses the ultimate, pulls it back, but doesn't stun anybody, dashes dash. into a wall, and Rapio's there to try and bail him out. Spudio is still alive throughout all of this, but Jake's ultimate, finally the one to take him down. Kana still trying to fight back, but Rapio knocks him away, and now it's Jake on the run. Ultimate from Julio, gets the knockup. Jake used the beat, so he's not pulled back by Johnny this time, but he still gets hit by the knockup. And it's Rapio dashing right in aggressively. Jake goes down, double for the mid laner of Mambo. That's the fight for the Gilda Gladiators that they were praying for. Five versus four with Johnny on the way back to base. Johnny only involved for the last Composition. five seconds. They can isolate individuals, but Jengaru's not a standard mage and he might just be dead. Not just a might, it is a definite dead for him. Rampage now for Johnny. Five, one, and four. And they were playing around it so well just to threaten the tanks of the Gilda Gladiators. We've seen pulls on Kana, we've seen pulls on Jake, and they've both gone rewarded. Fire Giant star by Hex Mambo. Kana spots it out and thinks twice about even trying to step towards the pit. So, first major objective now for Hex Mambo on the right side in that fire. It'll be traded by a Gold Fury for Gilded Gladiators. But Hex Mambo already starting their group up. The Titans are pushing up mid lane now. It's the rest of Hex Mambo already pushing up mid. Kirby pushed away. Jake goes in with the ultimate. Does manage to get the ultimate out of Rapio in response. Kiri dives down in to try and take down Rapio, but he's just so tanky. The shells, the meditations, they're keeping him alive. Rapio Turn. just will not die. Finally goes down to Awesome Jake, but it's already down to now a 4v4. Soul laner gone for the Gilded Gladiators, and Jake all by himself. It might be a two for one as Jake gets caught out. Johnny's swinging away, and Spudio with the enhance takes him out. Force it immediately. Jumping into that back line, Rapio is already channeling Tycho Drum, so Kirmi lands with ultimate, and it's shoved into a wall. You're not getting a whole lot done on the rat there, forced to disengage at fear of death, and all of a sudden the rest of Hex Mambo are free casting. Right side Phoenix to Hex Mambo. Mid Phoenix open, but no minions fight, there, so couldn't use it there. But if he had that, if he had the timeline proc ready to go as well, Johnny's that on the hunt. Snoopy might want to run away fast. Goes up with the ultimate, but where does he land? You go to the group of three. It seems to be the call. Immediately, Spudio answers with an ultimate of his own. Jake gets stunned out. Kirby off the tree on top of Kha'Zix, but that's not the target that he really wants to go for. Kana tries to get to the back line. Does the damage. Jengaru finds a double stun, but he can't even get a good transform back off. Spudio falls down. Health bar's a bit low on the side of the Gladiators, and it's gonna be the call for a tree because Julio is in the back line. It's just going menace mode up against Snoopy. He can't even do damage to Julio. Julio's returning it all back wow. to him. And it's a kill for Julio, maybe an extra for Johnny. Has the jump, lands on Kirby, feather step. Takes him down, and now it's only three alive on the Gladiators. Jangaru's struggling to escape out of the jungle. Johnny's got eyes on him. But maybe it's Kana on the chopping block. Either one would be massive. Kana pulled back in, and Johnny picks up his second. Chase doesn't stop. Can you take down a bird from this position? Jengaru still hasn't reset. Two versus four. Can the Gilded Gladiators hold back? Awesome Jake standing behind. Left side Phoenix gets hit by a Runic Bomb, slowed down its attack speed and ill of its HP gone. Can the four fight two under the Titan? Jengaru steps what? up. What? That's the last step that he gets to take. Now it's Jake 
versus four. Hex Mambo walk right into the throne room, and they don't care about what this Charon can do. The Titan down to half. Nobody back on respawn. Shake's thrown around like a rag doll at the hands of Hex Mambo, who take game number one. I don't even think Mambo wanted to end, J-Mac. They were walking towards mid. They just spot J- Second. They got their grasp on that game. The second the gold lead extended to 500. But even...